So here we are at the Mountaineer Wind Energy, Energy Center in Thomas, West Virginia. It is a 44 turbine, 66 megawatt wind energy facility. And the uh, wind's about uh, 10 to 12 miles an hour right now. They've slowed down a little bit. Uh, first time being up close to a wind farm. They're, they're kind of noisy. You can hear the blades turning in the wind, but it's not that bad. Nothing like what I've heard on other YouTube videos. Now the wind has slowed down and so has the turbine. And you can see more of them in the background. And there's Phil and Kayla arguing as usual. Yes, it has slowed down significantly. I don't know if you can see the blades, but there's a slight amount of snow buildup on the blades. It does throw some of it off occasionally, but I haven't seen any large chunks come flying off that might be deadly. I don't know if you can hear them, but you can hear the ones in the background turning as well. Definitely not as loud as some people have said that they are. You can see one with feathered blades in the background. Here's a little sign, Mountaineer Wind Energy Center and Exelon Energy Marketing Partnership, owned and operated by FPL Energy, Community Energy. And now some in the background have started to speed up, and this one has decided to slow down. You can see a anemometer mast there in the background to measure wind speed. Yeah, I don't know if you can hear the noise. They're they're slightly noisy, but you know, there are blades turning in the wind, so you'd expect them to be slightly noisy. But you know, I I when we pulled up in the, in the truck, I couldn't hear them, so it's probably nothing I could that you know would be totally unbearable. This one started to spin again a little bit. NEG Micon turbines bought and now owned by GE Wind Energy. And now it's starting to spin up again.